went on a date with this girl. She saw her ex-boyfriend on another boat. So she jumped in and started swimming, visiting Miami. So I match with this very fine female named Brooke. And in her bio, it says she's a Scorpio and that she wants to be roasted. So you know what I did. So because I'm a gentleman, I asked for permission that she really wants to be roasted. And she told me to give me her best. So I gave her my best. So I tell her, you're the type of girl that puts her zodiac sign in her bio to seem relatable and down to earth but you really don't believe in it and you want people to roast you because you're not here to actually get to know someone. You're just on this app for the dopamine that you get every time you get a new match and you look for reassurance from an app that you're attractive when you've probably never been treated right because you're always looking for the next big thing and actually you don't trust guys at all based on how you've been treated in the past. So you decide to make Tinder as a joke just to see you're capable of matching with. And she unmatched me. So I think I did, I think I won. Tinder pickup lines with 100% success rate, part one. Your sign to never use Tinder. I forgot herpes. What do I tell my mom? <laughs> <laughs> Let your soul gravitate to the love, y'all, y'all Don't get no people dying Children hurt and you hear them crying I need you to stop anyway. Left, 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 left right, 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 Where you get your grills from? I got them from uh, Johnny Dang. You lying? Yeah. Please don't take offense to this, but is your friend in your pick single? I'm so glad you asked. The purpose of online dating for me is actually to set up my friends. So is that a yes? Sure is. And I'm sure she'll appreciate the way you slid into my DMs just to get to her. Takes a real man to have that type of courage. I'm glad you can recognize a real man when you see one and I'm sure I have a friend I can convince to join us on a double date. Perfect, maybe you can make him feel bad for me by telling him that his friend swiped right on me just to get to another. Girl. That's funny and actually not a bad idea haha. <laughs> glad I can be of help. So what's the best way to impress your friend? The best way to impress her is to be a woman because she's gay. And this interaction makes me wish I was too. what they like to do for fun. This guy on Tinder this morning was like, so what do you do in your free time? Well, sir, when I'm not dying at work, I like to get blackout drunk on the weekends, make toxic choices, regret my whole life, and then repeat the cycle. What do you like to do for fun, Brian? Not dating in 2021 anymore we're not doing it bumble hinge tinder get your shit together we're going full-blown arranged marriages okay choose my spouse for me i don't even care at this point it doesn't matter do they breathe are they nice okay we're good make it happen
normal music. <laughs> I agreed to go on a Tinder date, and he brought me to play UFC with his friends. You. Where are the sheep? His mom is mad I am here. I'm scared. Come stay. I have been alone in the basement for 30 minutes. I don't think he is coming back. Ooh, are you okay? The night after that Tinder hookup. Girls have Tinder profiles that are like, swipe right if you have a boat, take us out drinking for the day. <laughs> and all I can think about is this scene from Always Sunny. Yeah, the, the, the what? The mattress? What do we need a mattress for? What do you mean, what do we need a mattress for? Why in the hell do you think we just spent all that money on a boat? The whole purpose of buying the boat in the first place was to get the ladies nice and tipsy topside so we can take them to a nice, comfortable place below deck and, you know, they can't refuse because of the implication. Oh, uh, okay. You had me go in there for the first part. The second half kind of threw me. Well, dude, dude, th think about it. She's out in the middle of nowhere with some dude she barely knows. You know, she looks around her. What does she see? Nothing but open ocean. Ah, uh, there's nowhere for me to run. What am I going to do? Say no? Okay. That, <laughs> <laughs> that seems really dark. No, no, it's not dark. You're misunderstanding me, bro. I'm, 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 I think I am. Yeah, you are. <laughs> because if the girl said no, then the answer obviously is no. No. But the thing right. is, is she's not going to say yeah. no. She would never say no because of the implication. I remember when, I remember, I remember when I lost my mind There was someone so pleasant about that place Damn, double homicide Bitch! Bimo! Huh, I'm eight and a half inches Damn dude, this guy's tiny, he must be a dwarf Sorry, I'm not interested in being friends with midgets. Midgets piss me off. Frowny. It's Tinder for you and your partner, and it shows you movies that you can swipe right or left on, so it'll let you know when you both match on a movie, so you don't have to f***ing argue about what you're gonna watch anymore! My roommate was swiping on Tinder and didn't realize I was filming a thirst trap. Fuck his vegan. <laughs> I'm 33. My knees click when I walk. I'm overweight. I'm lazy. I'm tired. this game.
Okay, so back when I was in the hospital uh, for being paralyzed completely under my shoulders, couldn't move or feel anything, uh, I thought that was the perfect time for getting on some dating apps and finding love. So here's how that went. So I kicked it off with this nice photo of me from seven years ago, and then boom, this guy cannot get out of bed alone. He needs a lift. We got a nice beach pic. Here you can see under my clothes. And he's got a catheter coming out of his pants. Now here's the kicker, this is my bio. It says, recently paralyzed. My neck brace can hold up to 150 pounds. Come and take a seat. I'm not even coming back on here, ever. I keep coming on here and talking. Tinder is the perfect place to find husband. It's somebody else's husband, but there's lots of husbands there. <laughs> Yes, 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 shit, and this, who the fuck eats salad, shit off. Men I've met on Midwestern Tinder. This is a football, this is a fish. Cool, so do you have any personality traits? No, I do not. Okay, how about you? What's up? I'm a low-key alcoholic. I'm six foot four, because apparently that matters. I'm in a frat and I don't know how to do my laundry. Yikes, what about you? Good day, my lady, and can I just say that you are a radiant beam of sunshine onto this earth. I've never seen anyone as glorious as you, but sigh. No one like you would ever like someone like me. Girls just don't like nice guys. Ooh, you are coming on very strong. I'm gonna need you to reel that in. Well, you're a fucking bitch and I hate you. Sure. How about you? Hey, I really like your style. Thank you, man. And I really dig yours, too. I actually got this from the thrift store that I work at. And I couldn't help but notice we have, like, the same music taste. Man, that is so cool. And I saw that you like history and philosophy. I love history and philosophy. Oh man, that's dope. Especially since you're a woman and women are fucking stupid. There it is. You almost had me. That was good. Tinder's for rookies. Go to Facebook Marketplace and search for wedding dresses. It'll show you recently divorced females in your area. From there, you can filter by size.